So today we've been working on setting up Olive a little bit better accommodations. She was out there for the last few days in that truck topper with that little house with the heat lamp, but she likes to have more room than that, I'm sure. So we have her a larger area here that she can live in. And we got her a little play set because you know, all pigs like to have a little playground in their pen. So this is where she's gonna stay for now. I think she'll be safe and at night we can lock her in that little room there, that little pen so that anything big can't get to her. And then she should be happy, I would say. We just had to make a little, couple little changes to this gate here. This needed to be lowered so she couldn't slip underneath it. And then I had to get some stuff out of this area that the kids had thrown in here. And then we had to get this fence here connected so I can remove it if I need to really easy. But in the meantime, she can, she can't get out. We can open the barn door if we want to let some more air through, but We'll probably have that closed for now because it's getting cold out. So yeah, I think she'll be pretty happy in here. Right now she's out running around on her own. What are you tempting her with? Uh, um, some packets. You better get in there. These accommodations remind me of like Charlotte's Web. If you ever seen that? Yeah. <laughs> kind of reminds me. Of. We got the pig here, and we have the ducks. She's right next to the ducks. house in here in her new pen so that she feels somewhat comfortable because she's been staying in this little house. Plus, we built it so we might as well use it. We're going to have a heat lamp still in here so it gets real cold out. We can turn it on and so she can stay extra warm in here. It smells like pig in there. trying something new with the duck's water because they make such a mess. Yeah, you. You make a mess. 